up with connected with us 6000 people on asim facebook live stream they can also see us because this is live stream there and then every week we will try to put the recordings on asim.co so those who cannot see us so i will just jump out jamila after introducing you and then you are good to do right because you will be the co-host with all the rights right so i'll be back and forth uh wonderful you can see the screen so welcome everyone officially from asim and jamila let's start with you jamila is based in north america a veteran very expert into early childhood development for decade but jamila i would like you to tell something more about you better than me and then we'll we'll start the training for you okay yeah um my name is uh, jamila vilani and i have been in uh, usa for 21 uh, 29 years now um i have done my montessori training shell for are their child size all the materials are placed uh by their eye level and each child is working their own this is a example from the montessori school uh other preschools are also doing the same way uh this is how you can prepare let's see what is a key point for the prepared environment i think every year so Uh, in our class also uh, we would uh, encourage the children to bring one plant and uh, we do take care of the plant we we want rapid growth in height and weight development of fine motor and gross motor skills example crawling walking jumping we can give more skills for the language where he is able to learn english because the children are coming from diverse cultures in america everybody knows english we do not have that um problem or issue here but i know the countries uh, in pakistan afghanistan india and other parts third world countries you know uh the, the, it includes gross motor skills such as crawling walking running and fine motor skills such as the fine motor sk- skills are such as grasping or holding the object drawing and using utensils or using a pencil holding a pencil in a proper way using the physics that they should uh, to uh, they should know how to recover quickly from difficulties every person should be a resilient person we all should be a resilient person all we all have some difficult time is coming through our lives so we all have to learn to trust and, and enhance social situation so when they born they start trusting the relationship when they are uh when any situation happen that if the thunder is happening if the lights are off if there's a dark they start to trusting uh their relationship their friends their brother sisters their parents their caregivers that they are so, with this and then you can reach out to the parents and you can talk to them about your concern and they have to take the charge of the, the doctor and do more evaluation so observation and assessment play a crucial role in early childhood development for several reasons individualized support observing and assessing child's development allows educators caregivers and ongoing professional development cultural exchange activities and incorporating diverse perspectives into the curriculum providing equitable opportunities create an environment where all students have equal opportunities to succeed. the child's emotional well-being and social development cognitive development families can provide a stimulating environment that promotes cognitive development simple activities like Local reading culture history and traditions into the curriculum reflecting the community identity and values this approach promotes a sense of pride and belonging among students parents and community involvement in school governance <laughs>